Hi friends, please subscribe to Top 10 World. Today video is traveling to UAE, Singapore, Kuwait from India. No latest travel guidelines. Singapore travel guidelines, fully vaccinated passengers traveling to Singapore from tomorrow on VTL flights from Chennai, Delhi and Mumbai will have their travel history requirement reduced from 14 to 7 days. People from India traveling to Singapore, UAE and Kuwait will be able to visit both these as the travel restrictions has been eased by both the countries. According to Singapore Airlines, fully vaccinated passengers traveling to Singapore from tomorrow on VTL flights from Chennai, Delhi and Mumbai will have their travel history requirement reduced from 14 to 7 days. SIA said in a statement, from the 22nd of February 2022, Singapore time, fully vaccinated passengers traveling to Singapore on VTL flights from Chennai, Delhi and Mumbai can adhere to the new relaxations. Travel history requirement will be reduced from 14 to 7 days. If the traveller has been in Singapore within those last seven days, his her stay in Singapore can be counted towards fulfilling this seven-day travel history requirement. Also, from February 22, VTL travellers need not take an on-arrival PCR test at Changi Airport. Instead, they will be required to take a supervised self-swab antigen rapid test at any test centre located across Singapore within 24 hours of arrival, it said. A testing notice with a web link to book tests will be issued to travellers upon their entry into Singapore. If the above art is negative, no further art PCR tests are required throughout one's stay in Singapore. The new changes to Singapore's VTL entry and testing requirements follow the government's announcement last month exempting VTL travellers from all testing requirements if they had recently recovered from COVID-19 within 7 to 90 days of their last infection before departure to Singapore and can provide appropriate documentary proof of their recovery. Meanwhile, UAE has also updated its travel guidelines for people travelling from India. These include passengers who have completed the full vaccination schedule of both doses in India are exempted from RT-PCR testing prior to departure for travel to India from UAE. Passengers should also upload COVID-19 vaccination certificate issued in India on Air Suvidha portal. All other passengers should carry a negative COVID-19 RT-PCR certificate and upload the same on Air Suvidha portal. The test should have been conducted within 72 hours prior to scheduled time of departure. All passengers should submit complete and factual information in self-declaration form on the online Air Suvidha portal before the scheduled travel, including last 14 days' travel details. All passengers will continue to undergo thermal screening on arrival and if found symptomatic, will be treated as per protocol. After UAE and other Gulf country Kuwait has also announced some relaxations to people travelling from India to Kuwait. The new guidelines include passengers accept visa on arrival in Kuwait with valid travel documents can enter the state of Kuwait despite their vaccination status. 1. Fully vaccinated only vaccine approved by Kuwait government are not required to take RT-PCR test to travel to Kuwait. 2. Partially vaccinated and unvaccinated passengers are required to take RT-PCR test to travel to Kuwait. Passengers who have taken two doses of vaccination approved by Kuwait and have completed nine months since the second dose are considered partially vaccinated. 3. Children under the age of 16 years are exempted. 4. Partially vaccinated and unvaccinated guests are subject to home quarantine for seven days.